it's I don't know. I have I have I'm 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 in a job where I have to do things in the office from time to time, honestly. Um, you know, I can't do everything remote. It's just all of the things that I currently do have to do in the office are things that are not priority in any way, shape, or form. Uh, they deal with a lot of, like, I don't know. They deal with a lot of, um, what's the word I'm looking for? They deal with a lot of the physical collection um, and trying to, like, not get, not even necessarily get things into shape, but, like, make things available. And uh, we aren't letting anyone do things with them at the moment, for the most part, you know. So, you know, nothing's going to happen for a while, <laughs> um, which is fine. But, yeah, for right now, there's not a whole lot going on. And kind of just waiting for the end of the semester, which is a weird feeling. Um, not totally weird, I guess. I should walk that back. This happens every year. You know, my job is a very feast or famine kind of position. I will have way too much to do at the beginning of every semester, way too much for any one person to handle. And then by the end of the semester, I'm twiddling my thumbs waiting for the next time that I'm going to be busy. <laughs> um, and the key thing that I always have to try for is to avoid taking on too many other things that then I have to drop when it gets busy again. Um, like I'm thinking about running for election for a, um, and now, um, what's it called? Professional conference post, um, being a chapter liaison for a particular, part of the professional organization I'm part of. This is very confusing, but yeah. Um, and I put running in giant scare quotes because I doubt that anyone else is running. And if I nominate myself, then I will probably get it. Um, and the deadline is the 12th. And so I'm like on the fence because I'm like, this doesn't seem like it will be that much more work, but I am in grad school. Full, I am in grad school half time. I am working full time. And what happens when it starts getting busy again? I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, that's that's where the brain is at the moment. Uh, right, exactly. Um, trying to avoid that. Ooh. Ugh, excuse me. Mm. It's a good start. Mm, tired. Alrighty. So today we are playing Tangle Tower. I realize that I just I haven't started it yet, so give me a hot second. I'm gonna start that. Um so I might disappear for a teeny bit. Oh well, maybe not. Yeah, nope, never mind. I can set it to be windowed ahead of time. Um Okay, so yeah, I guess we'll get started. I have no idea what that's about. I hope that's not... No, my thing is not on. Okay. That seems to be working fine. The audio is there. Just make sure my... Nope. Knitting ornaments? Oh, that sounds adorable. Let's see if this works. Yay, there we go. Sort of. <laughs> it's just too large. Um, hold on. Things I should have done before. Yep, 
Yeah, there we go. That'll work. Figure skates with embroidered initials and paper clips for the blade. That sounds adorable. I cannot emphasize how adorable that sounds. Oh, shoot. I hope that didn't mess anything up. No. Okay, good. <laughs> Buffering? Um... I mean, I'm not seeing any issues on my end. That is also just me. Let's double check. My current things. Nope, that's not how I spell Twitch. Yeah, no, things are looking okay on my end. You might want to just try refreshing, yeah. Um, because, yeah, I'm not seeing any issues, um, on my dashboard here. Yeah, bitrate's stable. Don't know what to say. We haven't started yet, though, so there's that. We are about to start, so... Unfortunately, so I have watched a little bit of Let's Plays with this just to see kind of what I was getting into. And unfortunately, one of my favorite things from um, Detective Grimoire was how they had, you know, they, they were the same loops. They weren't like a new thing for every piece of piece of dialogue, but they were animated. You know, the characters themselves were actually animated. It seems like they dropped the animations, unfortunately, for static sprites. Which makes me sad. Grimoy, Grim, Grimory. <laughs> I'm not sure if I can even pronounce it properly. It's a bird bath. It's birds. Is that just rainwater? It looks a little weird. The birds seem to like it. They're even singing a little tune. Please don't do that. I think that's actually Sally. I think that's actually Sally. What's wrong, CJ? I typed about it to the mooring post, so it'll stay put. For now. Loving your confidence. <laughs> Good. Mountains. Nope. They're too steep and too smooth to be mountains. So what are they then? They're more like cliffs. Okay, fair enough. Whatever they are, they go all the way around the lake, like a barrier. What are they? Wind chimes. Silent, wooden wind chimes. That's a big lake. It's kind of purple. It looks poisonous. I think it's just water. Yeah. Water with poison in it. <laughs> Good. Are you ready, Sally? Grimoire, I've been standing here for seven and a half minutes. Just checking. Do you have the map? Uh, yeah, but it's basically blank. Did you read the case file? What do you think? I'm not sure yet. It's really not a lot to go on. I got nothing to go on. You read it. Yeah, I'll read it on the way to the crime scene. Here we go. Freya Fellow, 19, died whilst painting a portrait of Flora Fellow. Single stab wound on her chest. No weapon was found at the scene, but the subject of Freya's unfinished painting is holding a knife. <laughs> what do you have there? A knife! No! The red color on the tip of the knife is not paint. It was discovered to be blood. Well, that's something. 
Okay, so we got paintings that will kill you now. Fellow family and the Pointer family. Okay. I think it's to scare away. Yeah, I feel like that meme is just going to keep coming back on this channel. With the number of murder mysteries we do, it's just too easy. No. And it's great. It's a statue of some hideous, scaly, bipedal fish monster. Playing a harp. Playing a harp. Hang on a second. This oh. This isn't just a regular oh. statue, is it? Something tells me we're not going to solve this just yet. I don't know what to say. Let's come back later. It must do something. You'd hope so, wouldn't you? Okay, these are... Alright, um... Let me see if there's anything I might be able to do on my end here. I mean... My hmm. I'm trying to see if there's anything that I can see on the streams and if there's any Content, no. I mean, I can't really change output settings right now. Regardless. I don't know, everything looks fine on my end. Uh, like when I'm viewing the stream itself. I mean, not. So I, I don't know, I don't know what's wrong. I have no idea. try one other, other idea. I'm check I'm having somebody check it now. Um I mean, yeah, everything looks fine on my end is the problem. Like my bitrate is completely flat. It is not jumping at all. There was another dashboard I found at one point. I can't find it though. Um, I 
Oh. Thank you for subscribing, Lord Melvin. Thank you very much. <laughs> I asked him to just come in and take a quick look at the stream, and then he ends up subscribing anyway, but thank you. Boop. Boop. I've got cute little emotes for everything. Huh, yeah, no, it. I hate to say that it's a you problem, but it sounds like it's a you problem. I'm yeah, because I'm I'm not seeing anything on my end that's showing any kind of drop in quality. Um, uh, Twitch inspector, that's what I wanted. Yeah. Unstable events, zero. I've had like one weird spike, but it was pretty much right at the start of the stream. So I don't know what to say. No delay either. Sorry, CJ. I wish I had better. I wish I had something better to say on that front. Um... All right. Where were we? An ancient stone carving. Wonder how it got cracked. I think it's supposed to look like that. It's an egg. This is some garden. Do the planks all look a little strange to you? Everything looks strange. This whole everything it's looks strange. Stand. Bit small for a bandstand. It's a one-man bandstand. That's not what that's called, but okay. What animal is that? Hawk, bear, lizard. Right, of course, a hawk, bear, lizard. And it's full of the same weird water that was in the lake. Any fish in there? Not a single one. Although there is something in there. It's a cassette tape, or it used to be. Ugh. Ah, okay. And it's full of Any fish in there? Not a Although there it's a cassette or it used to be. Oh, okay, so it's just going to show me the same thing again. Okay. Yeah, really useful, right? It's quiet. Mm -hmm. You're supposed to say, too quiet? It's not. It's an appropriate amount of quiet. <laughs> it's an appropriate amount of quiet. There's an O on the floor. Oh, yeah. Tangle. Twer. Twer. <laughs> oh. What? Oh. Oh, yeah. Tangle. Twer. Is that an envelope? It's been opened, but the letter is still in. Twer. Let's read it. Isn't that an invasion of someone's privacy? Oh, definitely. <laughs> oh, definitely. Combination is drawn on the other sheet. Once you have it memorized, destroy it. I do not agree with your reasons. You will not find it down here. Oh. Interesting. The fact that things don't disappear is kind of throwing me off. If we try to go inside? No, I think he'll just silently judge us. Little bird feeders. How do you know they're for birds? Yeah, there's a heart engraved in the tree. I didn't know people actually did that. PPFF. Looks like someone tried so. to chop it down, but then gave up. Can you blame them? Hmm. Should we ring the doorbell? Why would we not? A doorbell. It's a little melody. Huh. There's a lot of music in this one already. Don't think it's locked. Oh, that means we can just walk straight in, right? I'm pretty sure that's the rule, yeah. Hmm. 
Let's head to the crime scene first. It's at the top of the West Tower, I think. Oh no. Oh jeez. A big letter S. Of course. Who doesn't hang a giant banner of their initial in the lobby of their mansion? This one has a big P. That's probably important. Stretching real hard there, buddy. Deceptive of you. What is that? I think it's a family tree. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Selena Stonetop. No family line. Apparently, she just appeared out of nowhere. Felicia Fellow. Freya's mother. Do you think she still lives here? Freya Fellow. The murder victim. She's barely related to the main family at all. Damien Dusk. Whoa. Is it too late to change my name to Detective Dusk? <laughs> it's Freya's father. Do you think he still lives here? Lord Fellow. Looks like he was married twice. Scandal. Lady Scandal. Do these people not have first names? Flint Fellow. A purebred fellow, if there ever was one. Married a randomer, though. Do you think he still lives here? Emily Everstone. Do you think she still lives here? It's very... Every, everyone, do you think she still lives here? Do you think they still live here? Do you think he still lives here? Felix Fellow. Looks like he married his way into the Remington family. Do you think he still lives here? Lord Remington. He sounds important. Lady Remington. I think I have one of these in my bathroom. <laughs> Good. Flora Remington. I think she's mentioned in our case file. Fiona Fellow. Dead center. She must be important. She's half Fellow and half Remington. Do you think she still lives here? Richard Remington. Someone that we remember. The one and only. Primrose Remington. I always liked the name Primrose. Do you think she still lives here? Do you think they still live here? This goes back a couple of generations. Yeah, as I say, there's a lot of people to possibly meet How here. do you become a lady? I want to be a lady. You and me both, sister. Percival Pointer. Why don't I have a goddamn title? Married into the Remington family. Do you think he still lives here? Pandora Pointer. All this alliteration isn't happening by accident. Do you think she still lives here? Buck Brackley. What a name. Do you think he still lives here? Penelope Pointer. Half Pointer, half Brackley. Do you think she still lives here? Poppy Pointer. She's half Remington and half Pointer. Do you think she still lives here? Do you think he still lives here? Do you think she still lives here? Do you think he still lives here? I don't know. Did we do any research at all? Or like... A big glass tube filled with water. There are leaves in there. In sand. It's an aquarium? Could be. Except there's nothing living in it anymore. Hmm. Finally, we get to investigate a murder in a spooky mansion. It's not that spooky, really. Don't ruin this. <laughs> Don't ruin this. Stairs. All right. Stairs. Stairs. Let's take a look at that painting first. No hello? Okay. There it is. The unfinished portrait of Flora Fellow. So, what? Freya was killed halfway through painting it? Looks that way. Reminds me of the Dragon Age illustrations. It's 
So the red substance is blood. And Freya was killed by that knife in the painting. I wonder if all of Freya's paintings are Oh hey, it, something is animated at least. There's something wrong with the crime scene and something really weird about the murder weapon. We didn't find a murder weapon. Fella is holding a knife that was blood, but it was removed from the scene. Nope. This music sounds familiar. This is from the. You don't need. You don't need a hint. Laura's corpse is holding a knife that was blood because it stabbed Freya. Portrait stabbed her. What? <laughs> What? You think Freya was stabbed by a painting, not by the woman from the painting, but by the painting. Freya was going to eat it. Mm -hmm. Freya was standing right up by the canvas when she was killed. There's blood on the knife. It's the murder weapon. Right, but it's not actually a knife. It can't stab. See any other knives around here? Case closed. The case is not closed. And even if you were right, where does that leave us? A painting can't be a murder suspect. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Boom, solved, broke credits. Bam, we're done. That's it. <laughs> Seriously, though. <laughs> There's a single patch of blood, right in the middle. No real signs of a struggle. That's weird. What? Her feet were right up by the canvas. So? So she was probably standing really close to the canvas when she fell. I'll check the case file again. Alright, what are we looking for? Yeah. She was stabbed in the chest, but she was standing right in front of the canvas. There's no hole in the canvas. I hate to tell you, Sally, but I'm pretty sure. Supposedly, Freya was working on the painting when she was killed. Looks like she was still holding her paintbrush and palette when she fell. Didn't even get a chance to clean her brush. Hmm. Freya's painting supplies. Cracked down one side. Interesting. Freya's painting supplies. Oh, well, didn't need to do that twice. Is that a gramophone? I think so. Except it's got a tape deck instead of a turntable. It's also got a big crack down the middle. What's with everything being cracked? So why would you have a set tape? Sure is. Dang. Crack down the middle. Huh. This is works. something. A yeah, you could give it a go. Yes, it is very heavily based on Gymnopity. Just saying.
Those are some... Great sound effects. Let's try this one. I'm sure this is going to work really well. Oh my god, it might be the little girl, honestly. She's gonna show up at some point and I'm gonna be like, ah, fuck. <laughs> this child is back. Moriarty. Somehow the sunlight doesn't seem to be making it very far into the room. We're at the top of the tower, right? I think so. Why? Doesn't matter. It's nothing. Hmm. Doesn't sound like nothing. A little pot plant. Balanced on the window ledge. It's the only plant in the entire room. Is that an egg? An egg with bird feet. It's also covered in gemstones. What a completely ordinary object. <laughs> yeah, no, we're looking at this. I think it's a container for something. Those gems look like they come off. I think I'm getting this. Uh, yeah. Okay. Short is purple. Blue. green one goes here. I've already put that green one somewhere, so. Is there another? I think I'm doing this right. Okay. Did I do it wrong? <laughs> no. Blue to red. Yeah. Um. Pink to pink here, yeah. Purple to blue, yeah. Oh, it should be right. Yeah, 
That woman is just like watching me play with this jeweled egg that is probably priceless, and I'm just like, huh? Hmm. Am I doing something wrong? That's the one. Hey, not bad. Oh, I thought it was just gonna automatically unlock. Leaving without a clue. And since the egg is a clue, right? Hmm. Alright. Well, I did it. Flora Pillow. Oh. Hey, sorry to barge in. I'm sure you're still in some distress. We need to ask you a few questions, I'm afraid. Did you witness the murder, Flora? Nothing. What do we do? Not sure. She's entitled to her silence, I suppose. For now. All right. So, I'm already in love with this bitch. <laughs> Is there anything you would like to tell us, Flora? <laughs> just... just... I think that's how mm. she likes it. We'll just have to ask other people about her. Yeah, okay. Freya was painting your portrait yesterday. Is that right? Was this something you had planned with her ahead of time? Was there something special about yesterday? Did she talk to Freya at all while she was painting you? She's not going to answer us, is she? Nope. But at least we can say we tried. All right. Flora, you were definitely in the room at the time of the murder. Surely you must have seen something? Can you tell me anything about what happened to Freya? She's acting pretty suspicious, if you ask me. I don't know. Maybe she really doesn't know anything. How is that possible? All right. Well. Flora, this is your egg? Why do you keep it locked? Is there supposed to be something in there? Or is it always empty? Yeah, she's not going to say anything, is she? Is this your gramophone? Do you know why it's cracked? Did you ask Freya to paint this? Or was it her idea? What is that you're holding in the painting, Flora? Some people have been saying it's a knife. What do you have there? <laughs> A knife. No! All right. Well, that's... Were you close with Freya? How are you two related? Did you kill Freya? Grimoire. What? I don't even think she's listening. Oh, she's listening. Oh, yes, she is. Anything we should know? Any hobbies? Besides staring out the window? Someone do cosplay of her, because she, she's kind of amazing. So this will start working our way down the tower. Makes sense, right? It's also a lamp, for some reason. A little hand-painted statue. How can you tell it's hand-painted? Well, the paints are right there on the desk. Also, I mean, no offense, but you can just tell. Ooh, that was... 
That was a bit of a burn. Hmm. Yellow, black, blue, and white paints, but no red paint. There's clearly red paint in there. Hmm. Nice. A real treasure chest. How do you know there's treasure in there? Why else would it be locked? Plus, there's a treasure map hanging directly above it. What's the deal with that painting on the front? I'm not sure. We should check that treasure map, too. Okay. Hang on, I gotta get this to work. So we've got... Yeah, right here. I3. North. Nothing. Damn. Check the treasure map for clues, and what about that painting on the chest itself? It fits perfectly. I mean, the dragon, there's the mountain, there's the island, and the thingy. Oh, maybe it's because you're standing on the island. Okay, so it's I four. Still locked. I think there's a connection, but like they're different versions of the same thing, maybe. But you're facing north, so wouldn't that be I three I four north? What am I missing here? The birds. Something about the birds. H6 west. H6. We've got the dragon on the left, mountain on the right, birds, and the thing in the distance. H6 west. Final answer. I did it. There we go. Three times. Not bad. What was in the box? What's in the box? More wooden models. These are a little different to the one on the desk. Oh, hey, it's the family. Now we've got some red paint, though. Hmm. Isn't it? What does he do? Well, if you tell too many lies, he appears at the end of your bed in the middle of the night. Oh. <laughs> oh. It's a barometer, but it's broken. I've never seen a barometer that wasn't broken. Facts, though. Special drawing of a mountain on a moonlit night. Mood. <laughs> Hashtag mood. A hammock. It's kind of worn out. I would politely describe it as lived in. It's a magic lamp. Can we summon the genie? If we get really stuck, sure. That's a massive conch shell. Do you think it has a little crab living inside? I hope so. <laughs> I it's hope Earth. so. If Earth was made of paper and gave off a gentle pink light. The floor is covered in wood shavings. 
It's a drinking horn. Is it full of ale? Or mead, maybe? Right now it's just full of dust. Oh. An old wooden mask. Yeah, I can turn that up. Hold on. Shelf junk. Sir? Can you hear me? I'm Private Detective Grimoire. I have some questions for you. Grimoire. Good mysterious name. <laughs> I'd rather like it. Felix Is that better, I hope? At your beck and call. And uh, this is my colleague, Sally. Yeah, that's a perfectly good name as well. Thanks. If you would, Mr. Fellow, we Sally would... Sally Spears, though. I must say, I'm rather jealous of you two. Oh, yeah? Why is that? Out here solving mysteries, <laughs> exploring new places, uncovering secret rooms, hidden treasures. That's what life is all about. Secret rooms? Uh, generally speaking, you know, that sort of thing. Yeah, there's a secret room somewhere in this house. Sir? Oh, shoot. Can you hear me? Grim Felix, if you were uh, uh, out here, uh, that's all. There we go. So, Felix, what exactly do you uh, do? Is it not obvious? I'm an explorer. Explorer slash treasure hunter. Yes, well, There's definitely secret the rooms. We're talking like curse statues, spike pits. Uh, it's a little more sophisticated than that. But How I've boring. certainly seen my share of danger, if that's what you're asking. And, uh, if I may ask, uh, when did you retire? Uh, you listen here. Mm -hmm. uh, I may be between ventures right now, but it's simply Whoops. not in my nature to stay in one place for too long. I go wherever the winds of destiny take me. Don't uh -huh. you live here with your wife and daughter? Yes, well, the fellow family has certain loyalties. And with uh, Flora the way she is... Uh, Nothing wrong with raising a family, Mr. Fellow. <clears throat> Don't misunderstand me. Fiona and Flora are my entire world. They are the greatest treasure of all. Uh-huh. I was going to say, that was... Convincing? Why on earth would you want to know about that? The murder of Freya Fellow. The reason we're here. Ah, oh, right. Uh, nasty business. Uh, very unfortunate. <clears throat> I, I regret that I can't be of any help. Uh, but I wish you all the best in your investigation. Hear that, Grimoire? We're done here. Let's go. It's a simple question, Felix. Well, I'm sure you're up to it. I just... it's... Well, there's not much to tell. Uh, mostly, I was in my room by myself, uh, working on Flora's... Uh, working uh, on a project. <laughs> Your room is quite close to Flora's tower. You didn't hear anything unusual? What qualifies as unusual? What have you got? <laughs> what have you got? Uh... It was dusk. A feeling lingered in the air. Malevolent, perhaps. Uncertain, <laughs> as life itself. A bridged version, please. Right. Fine. I heard someone heading down the stairs. Just outside my room. The footsteps were calm, orderly. So I thought nothing of it. Shortly afterward, I heard a second set of footsteps going the same way. This time I could tell just from the sound that something was wrong. So I looked out into the hallway. I got a glimpse of Poppy disappearing down the staircase to the floor below. I didn't know what to make of it, to be honest. I thought perhaps she'd had a disagreement with Fitz, as I know those two are close. So I looked into his room, just in case, but it was empty as was the garden beyond his window. Back in the hallway, I bumped into a very concerned-looking Penelope. She was heading up Fellow Tower to find Professor Pointer, so I escorted her. We went into Flora's room. 
poor Freya was laying on the floor. Fiona, Poppy, Pitts, and Pointer were there already. Flora, too, of course. <laughs> Soon enough, well, this is going to be quite a thing. Left. Including There's a you. lot of people in Not this tower, I isn't there? I stayed. Flora needed me. Dearest Flora, a remarkable woman. <laughs> Been married over 20 years now. You two still get on? Yeah, of course. <laughs> what a question. Yeah. She hasn't gone quiet on you. It's true. She has an independent streak. She's uh, had it her whole life. She's the youngest of three. Always something of a lone wolf, you know? Just the way she is. Lone wolf is putting it lightly. She doesn't seem to want to talk to anyone. She just likes time to herself. Uh, Away from the company of other humans. Other humans? Other, well, yes. Uh, other people, you know. Yeah, that's some very interesting terminology used here. Dearest Flora, oh, you choose to. What does that mean? You're the one currently basking in his presence. <laughs> you tell, tell I wouldn't me. be surprised at this point. Let's move on. Uncommonly skilled as an artist, but Freya was so much more than her talent. As she helped me get started with my own painting, you know. It taught me what she knew about wood carving, too. Tremendous patience. She was ever so good with dear Flora. Freya and Flora were close? Oh, yes. Especially after, uh, especially recently. How are you related to Freya? Somewhat distantly, as it happens, uh, my father, Lord Fellow, was her grandfather. Uh, technically, that makes her a fellow. Let's just say, uh, there was some discussion over whether she ought to carry the name at all. Uh, there's a family tree in the Grand Hall. <laughs> they were all you so very close after the accident. What about her inheritance? Freya's parents died when she was around three years old. She came to live here shortly afterwards. Nobody left her a thing? I'm afraid not. She had no formal claim over anything at Tangle Tower. Interesting. Okay. Charming, isn't it? <laughs> Built by the Remington family originally. Dear Flora's father and his uh, <clears throat> associates. But now it's owned by you? By the fellow family? The Fellows and the Pointers have both come to claim a certain degree of ownership. And who named it Tangle Tower? Uh, Flora chose the name. <laughs> what does it mean? Oh, sorry, CJ. I, I don't know what else to say. It to uh, mean nothing at all. Um, something of a fresh start. From what? This really isn't for me to say, but she had some kind of disagreement with her siblings. <laughs> After they moved away, Flora changed the name of the house. I think perhaps she hoped it would make them feel unwelcome. Yes, less likely to come back. That's kind of extreme. <laughs> yes, it is rather, isn't it? Hmm. <sighs> um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I can do to help make this better for everyone. Alright, I'm... All right, I'm gonna go ahead and try restarting the stream. Um, not even gonna move off of the screen. Be back in like a couple seconds. So sit tight, everybody. <laughs> 